Hello everyone and welcome to another video from Aria Vision. In today's video I'm going to show you guys how to upgrade your Dell 54 10 laptop with a new MB2 SSD drive. To doing so what you need? You need to have IFX screwdriver set, IFX opening tool and of course you need to have the MB2 drive. All right, so let's uh, move on uh, to my uh, on top camera, and then from there, we I will show you guys how to open the laptop. All right, so uh, I'm using at the moment the on top camera, which is uh, Logitech uh, C920. Okay, so let's uh, flip over the laptop and uh, the first thing that we need, we need to actually open up all the, the screws. Okay, so let's take the correct bit. For this uh, laptop to open it, you uh, need to add the star bit. Alright, okay, so uh, I'm always uh, opening first the middle part and then uh, the edges, so so it will be like one, two, three, four, five. Why I'm doing that? Because if you open it by uh, by sequence, like one, two, three, four, five, six, it may be when you open this side, that it will kind of uh, put pressure on the other side. So always try to open up the edges uh, first. So okay, so uh, that is how actually I have learned, and from the experience that I got now. That I'm opening always the edges uh, and then going to open, open up the other screws on the back cover. Okay, so let's move on now to the side. Alright, so just mention one thing that this uh, video is not sponsored by uh, any person or any organization or any shop. Uh, this laptop was actually brought uh, from one of my uh, friends for, for me and he just wanted to upgrade his laptop and he brought also one uh, M2 drive that is uh, an M2 drive from a company called uh, Macron which actually I, I uh, saw every one of them it came out on my gaming laptop on, on this one on the novel all right so uh, from the opening to uh, IFX opening tool, uh, what I'm using always that is that uh, blue plastic, which is called like shot actually, also opening tool. I'm using this one always. Okay, so what you need to do, uh, you just need to open up uh, the back cover. So how you safely need to do, just put it here. So on that way, and then kind of uh, squeeze it. So let's, let's dry it. You see the laptop uh, back cover is actually open. And then just hold this one, okay. And maybe better to dry it up. Okay, not really. Did I miss any screw? No, I don't think so. Okay. Because always need to uh, check that there is uh, the the sides can be broken if you will not open it carefully okay so we are true so once it's true and then just kind of dry it okay just give circle let's check okay that's it so just take it like this insert it and then push it again insert it and push it Okay, the back cover is open. Okay, so let's put that on the side. Okay, so first of all, uh, what you need to do, just disconnect the battery. Uh, so that is a connector of the battery. Just simply uh, disconnect it. I think I can just do that. Yep, so that's it. The battery is safely disconnected from the motherboard. Okay, and then what uh, we need, 
Okay, so as you can see, that is the uh, RAM stack, and on this laptop is a 16 GB RAM, so we are not going to uh, upgrade the RAM. That is a wireless uh, card that is here, and that is M2 drive over here. So let's open up the M2 drive, and I see directly that I got. I need to open up two screws. Okay, so it's again, it's a star screw. So, so one, done. Second one, done as well. Okay, so uh, let's move that one. All right. Uh, the stream deck, I'm kind of trying to do something with the stream deck, and it's at the moment not working. Okay, so uh, as you can see, that is also uh, SSD drive, the N2 SSD drive, but it's kind of really small one and uh, to make it big you can just put in some kind of uh, I call that I forgot the name so yeah whatever anyway let's move on uh, converter so okay here we got uh, 512 uh, GB M2 drive and the original one was actually 256 so that was the reason that you want to actually upgrade these these laptops M2 drive okay so just simply whenever you're just putting an end setting don't make it like this you know just a little bit down and then press it gently it should make click noise and you're done okay so uh, one thing that whenever you're uh, taking any RAM stick or a Z drive or a anything with uh, or even the uh, wireless card never touch the uh, this gold part all right it is actually for the safety of your uh, drive because it will actually damage it all right so Okay, so I see uh, what is the uh, issue at the moment. Yeah, there you go. Uh, so as, as you guys maybe in the seven the beginning of the video, I'm using Stream Deck to control the cameras and everything else and even uh, to adding uh, titles like this. Uh, so I will be uh, doing an ultra video about uh, Stream Deck, how to uh, even create icons for the stream deck so if you're interested just please subscribe to my channel all right so so let's uh, come back okay the m2 drive is uh, installed um, the connector is connected back the battery connector is connected back so let's put the back cover back and actually we are done okay so on this video uh, it was actually to just show you guys how to uh, upgrade the SSD drive and where is it actually so I'm not gonna uh, show you guys uh, how to uh, install Windows because I think everyone knows that and uh, on this laptop I have already on that M2 drive I have already installed uh, Windows 10 which came with this laptop uh, so I'm not even actually going to uh, turn on the laptop uh, the only thing is, I will say that uh, whenever you just uh, upgrading it uh, the laptop make sure that you will uh, after you have installed to drive or even before that that uh, before that you need to actually up update your bios and uh, sometimes when you are upgrading the drive you may get a pop-up that uh, tells you that the new drive has been uh, connected with uh, more uh, space or something like this and you need to press uh, to accept that all right, so uh, we are done. Everything is done. If, uh, if you like uh, this video, please give a uh, thumbs up, which is like, or share, and do not forget to subscribe to my channel. Once again, thank you for visiting, and have a good day.